China. It's me again. And that means it's time to open Rana's storybook. See, I have my goggles on. And if you have your goggles, you may want to put it on because the story for today is The Healing at the Pool. We are going to visit a pool in Jerusalem. It's not just an ordinary pool. It is a special pool called Bethesda. Why is it so special? Because people believe that this pool has a healing miracle power. So one day, Jesus went up to Jerusalem for one of the Jewish festivals. When he was walking past Bethesda pool, he saw a great number of people who were sick or blind or lame or paralyzed around the pool, hoping for miracles. There was a man who was lying there. He seemed very helpless. He has been sick for 38 years. Wow! 38 years is such a long time. It's even longer than your age and mine combined. When Jesus saw him lying there and he learned that he has been in this condition for such a long time, Jesus asked him, Do you want to get well? He replied, Sir! I have no one to help me to go into the pool when the water is stirred. And, and while I'm trying to get in, somebody else goes down ahead of me. Mm, I'm confused. Jesus asked, do you want to get well? The answer should either be, yes, I do, or no, I don't. But why did he answer Jesus with an excuse? But Jesus said to him, Get up, pick up your mat, and walk. And immediately, the man was healed. He became strong, and he could pick up his mat and walk. Wow. Little did he know that the source of healing miracle power is Jesus. Wow! Praise Jesus for such a wonderful miracle! Yeah. You see... Jesus is more than capable to bless us with healing miracle power. So when Jesus asks, do you want to get well? Simply put your faith in him and say, yes, I do. And surely you will be made well. Isn't that awesome, Rena? Jesus is more powerful than all doctors in the world. Trust in him and expect to receive his healing miracle. Amen. And that's the end of our story today. Alrighty, I shall see you in the next episode. Bye, Rena.